Hi, Jesse. Thanks for helping me with my video today. Hi, Carol. Thanks for warming me up for the gig tonight. Yeah. <laughs> so, have you always been into music, like your whole life, like from, since babyhood? I was four. Wow. I was four when I started taking lessons. Uh huh. Then I took lessons until I was, I don't know, 14. Yeah, music has always been it. And, and what kind of music were you studying? Classical. Yeah. Chopin, Bach, Mozart. And was that, was that your path, or did you kind of realize you were going to go into pop and jazz and funk and other stuff? I auditioned for Juilliard and I made it, and I was only nine years old, and when I went for the audition, I took a look at what Juilliard was, and I was just a kid, but it, I thought, this is very serious. I can't do this. This is going to be too serious and too competitive, and I won't be able to deal. So I didn't go to Juilliard, and then when I got to be about 14, I became a teenager and realized that nobody is going to, you get no action if you're playing Bach and Chopin. So I promptly figured out how to play the music my parents liked to sing. So I basically began to learn the standard songbook when I was 14. And I began to get paid for that when I was 16. I would accompany grown-up sing-along parties playing Ella Fitzgerald tunes and stuff like that. And that, of course, is the gateway to rock and roll. Did you enjoy that? Or is that like old fogey music? When you were a kid? I loved it. You loved it, yeah. What a change from Bach and Chopin. Uh -huh. Just a whole big world opened up and then I discovered Harlem. I wasn't living in Harlem, but I quickly began listening to the radio as we all did and we listened basically to black music. And guess where black music was? Harlem. And I began to regularly go to the Apollo. Wow. And that's when I realized, I can't be black, but I could be a funk player. I could play soul music if I could learn this. And I began to also go to the jazz clubs and sneak in. And I began to go to the Village Vanguard and see Thelonious Monk, who is my boyfriend. Yeah. Wow. So what's your favorite kind of music now and what are, what are you enjoying these days? <laughs> Hip hop. No, that's not right. No, I've been doing a lot of salsa uh -huh. and I've actually been singing salsa. So for me, that's exciting because salsa is my favorite kind of music and it has been for a long time. Okay, well, thanks, Jesse. Uh, anything else you want to say about what's coming up in the next year or next two years or what's, what's your future holding musically? Well, it feels like I'm playing now with three or four bands, and one is uh, Latin jazz, a lot of originals, a lot of bossa. The other is, of course, this uh, dance band. I'm in um, another band called Arroz Con Pollo, another funny name, which plays a fair amount of salsa, even though we're a five-piece band. That's cool. my future. Cool. Okay, well, thanks and have fun with that. Thank you, have, have fun, fun with this. This okay. video project is great. All right, thanks, Jesse.